first day of creation camp. Let's go. Oh, guys, come and come and got me breakfast. It's really, it's really yeah. So, thank you, Carmen. Rainy day today. Look at the little flag. So, why do you do it? When people in the Chinese community, when people join them, uh, the people in different way. The way we train the students to uh, do this hunting is to focus on one point. It's like, for example, they can draw the eyes of the person, and then they can start with the eyes and to draw the whole body. Uh, your classroom is upper floor in this building, same building. This is second floor. The classroom is third floor. Sorry. Okay, so we just had like our opening ceremony. <laughs> we just had our opening ceremony. We're on our way now to, I think, to just see our classroom. Shanghai have like 2,000 students, 200 got picked for the initial stage for this creation camp. So one out of every 50 got picked. I'm not sure if I'm making the mathematics, but basically Carmen was one of the final 10 that got picked for this creation camp. That's a big thing. Formal dinner with all of the students, um, and it was just lovely. Honestly, it was. I got to know some of the um, Chinese students, um, and it was very interesting to talk to them. And that they, 
um, when I talked to them, they were apologetic about the English, but the language barrier hasn't been that bad. I was worried about it before I came, but you know, it's been quite easy to understand them. Whenever they try to translate something from their language, they use, I think, an app on their phone so that we can try and guess what they're trying to say. But um, it's just been cool getting to know them. They are so, so kind. <laughs> how wonderful they are <laughs> that was just Claudia um yeah I'm just I re I'm really looking forward to getting to know everyone on this trip um we have one coming up in July this is Claudia <laughs> <laughs> yeah we have one coming up in July and then I think one at the end of this month I need to double check that, but Great start to the creation camp. Business or the education here, or uh, they start building the church, building the commercial area. All the traditional Shanghai food is somewhere near here. There's a there's a train called Ten Station. You take the line two from here and change it to Line Ten. There is one stop on Line Ten. You can check the Google Map. Or I can send you the name of the stop. The lecturer was kind enough to give us snacks to try. Okay, so I was really debating whether to vlog today because my phone battery died. Um, so I wasn't really able to capture, sadly. But um, we had our intro to um, the summer camp today, which was really interesting, talking about the customs of China and the culture and what we could possibly explore. And then um, I think that's all it for today. We're doing Chinese calligraphy tomorrow. Um, oh yeah, and I'm also singing. Chinese calligraphy is meant to uh, using this brush to write the Chinese characters. If you use a brush to write the English letters, it doesn't hold it. You have to push it at the back to hold it hard. And when you write it, you have to make keep it straight. You can't like lean on some way. sang in front of a crowd this pumpkin right here oh my gosh lord you know what's funny i told myself that i wanted to be more confident in my singing um and imagine this opportunity came up <laughs> um it was great like it was just great and what was so cool was that everyone was waving. We got given like these glowy things and everyone was just waving. 
and they were clapping they didn't even know the song beforehand and they were clapping and i was like what oh my god like what? <laughs> it's amazing uh basically the my church's kind of theme for the year is the awakening and i definitely feel like i've been awakened to who god has made me and for me singing i've been very insecure about that but um i've been in the choir for quite a while now and um, both back home and in southampton so to do this even this was a big big deal a big big deal so hopefully more to come I come from. I um. I come from the UK. Ah, UK. Yeah. Morning, guys. Uh, I was meant to do this yesterday, but I didn't want to disturb my flatmate. She's a light sleeper. Uh, I can't even put into words. Yesterday was just so much. So the basically the Chinese students uh, took us out to a restaurant. There was like, so not even bragging, but like 20 plus of them. Um, we went to a, kind of like a local restaurant, which wasn't too far from the uni. And uh, my gosh, we ate, oh my gosh, we ate. <laughs> if you see my pictures on Insta, um, you will see we ate. And they're just so funny. Uh, it was just a perfect evening. There was there was entertainment. There was dancing, lots of it. Um, I got to ride on the moped. <laughs> um, but I definitely say it was one of my best nights so far. Oh my gosh! And the Chinese students, you know, they are so kind, and um, they just they have this thing of um, like spending time together and just. The single food and spending time together is really a lovely custom that they have. Um, I can't even put it into words. When I say kind, I mean it's just they go above and beyond. Uh, a couple, Lily and Kola, that's his name. <laughs> they um, they ordered a taxi for ordered a taxi for us and then walked us back to our dormitory. It was just so kind of them. Um, you know, I was smiling when I went to bed, I was smiling to myself, I was like, Lord, you are good. Like, guys, when opportunities come in life, never mind whether they will work out or not, just take them, just take them. Uh, I shall speak to you later. To Hangzhou, eight o'clock, we meet at the right hand. Okay, so this is today's schedule. So we'll be going to Hangzhou to see the other. To see the other campuses. Should be good.
we just were just finished. Um, my mind's gone. So we've just finished. Uh, we were just not just. Oh my gosh, can I speak? We we're just at the Hangzhou campus. Um, the exhibition was amazing. I was like, whoa. Like, I need to catch up, <laughs> especially the oil painting pieces <clears throat> that I saw, they were incredible. It actually made me seriously consider, like, maybe even applying to the Hangzhou campus for graduate because I'd really love to master oil painting. And then after we had lunch, um, Juan took us to lunch. Uh, afterwards, I got to uh, check out the West Lake and get to know one of my uh, colleagues, colleagues, classmates. More, which was really cool. We're on our way now to the hotel, <sighs> and it is so humid. Like it, this is bringing out the worst in my oily face. Like. Off to dinner! Oh, where's everyone? stopped on the way I think I'm not sure who like one of the associates like one of our guides for the creation camp offered to buy drinks for everyone after <laughs> after the drinking games um, but we just hung around near the hotel reception I didn't partake <laughs> but um, <laughs> a lot of interesting things happened uh, there was Verley's argument. <laughs> there was Ty trying to capture Claudia on film. Um, but it was just mostly so funny. So, so funny. Like, Verley kept going. <laughs> she made the, uh, I would say, a very strong argument. Oh, but, like, currently now, I think they're all hanging around in Dan's room. I am. Um, I needed to rest. My feet is hurting me. Um, I got bit. So, um, I think my ankle's starting to get swollen. I don't even know. I'm gonna show you my feet to put you off. But yeah, I need to get ready for bed. And probably need to get ready. Mom. Okay, 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 sorry. Um, 
Um, so we just finished going to the, I'm um, kind of exploring the Shanghai campus, excuse me. Um, we checked out one of the colleges uh, which specializes in film and animation. And so after that, we went back to Professor Wu's house. Uh, his son treated us to McDonald's burgers and drinks. Blow 